felt good being in the jungle in the dark. I love the chorizo and the longaniza. This is the longaniza. Right here. That's, uh, I guess, rice and beans mixed in. Some Tortilla, of course. And a little bit of salad. And this is a huge grape right here. Right. And we're going to eat all kinds of stuff all day today. Experiment. I'm not going to eat armadillo. I am. So we're at the food festival today and it's like one huge party. Tons of sausage, tons of bands, just like in Antigua. I, I never realized in Latin America, or Central America at least, how popular marching bands are. I mean, they bring them in from all the local towns and everything. And now we're just going to find some crazy foods, hopefully some armadillo. We're going to challenge all that. Yeah, just fireworks, it's local. Man. We're here today with two from Norway, traveling around the world. We are with Marita, former Bollywood movie star, now nurse, and professional skier, Pedro. So what do you think about the bands playing here today in the food festival, Pedro? But it was really cool to see the bands. They were really good, they were synchronized, and were dancing. I'm like, but more important things, uh, have you met a lot of people in the bathroom? Yeah, I met this one guy. He was, uh, he was really stoked about the bands, actually. Uh, not the local bands, but more bands from Finland. He, he loved those. Uh, so he was all like heavy metal, like hardcore. He had even like a, a, a bullet through his, uh, he, he's been he shot, was he, 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 he was hardcore, he, he got shot just around the corner. Marita, what are your feelings about that? Oh, uh, well, I haven't, I, I feel pretty safe here, even though I'm the only white people, because you're Italian, you're, you're from Venezuela, Ecuador, and you're Portuguese, so I'm like, um, no, I, I feel safe, I don't think it's a problem at all. I don't think it's a problem either, but be careful in the bathrooms, yeah, you will yeah. meet people. What about the hotel that we're staying at? It's really nice, really good. Nice dog, nice people. Nice dog. It is a nice dog, and that's what we think is most important when you're searching for hostels around the world. Really scope out the dogs, ask a lot of questions, what they like to eat, how they're around people, because it is one of the most popular amenities that you'll find throughout Central and South America. But it's also important that the hostel has a public toilet, because otherwise it's impossible to meet people. It is because that's where you'll socialize. Yeah. So, uh, El Salvador now, but El Salvador, uh, we've met just a lot of people. We are now starting Mission Armadillo. Let's go get some. Yo quiero armadillo. We're on a mission to find. Vamos a ir entonces con esta canción, la número mañana. We looked for the uh, frog legs or armadillo. We had no luck. No Feed luck. Feedback was tomorrow, Sunday, is the exotic food day. Mm -hmm. So they're probably all in the jungle right now catching our food. Hunt. Hunting. So we found some um, sexual looking fruit. Either one's jelly or sugar. One looks like it's not so happy. And then one looks like it's very happy. <laughs> Are we live? This is two backpackers live in El Salvador, and we are at Oajua. Start. 
This is Two Backpackers Live. We are in El Salvador at Huajua, the food festival today. Is that wrong? Huajua. Is it? Is it? Is it? Huajua.